Discover these tried and failed things the Manhattan School of Music students avoid now at all costs at this acclaimed conservatory. Not scheduling for your registration appointment when you're supposed to. MSM is probably one of the fewest schools that still have an in-person class registration system in this day and age of internet-dominated world. Everyone has one chance per semester to schedule an appointment with a registrar in the lobby. You will get an email two weeks in advance about how the period lasts for two days only, so you better mark your calendar and get yourself down there to schedule an appointment. Booking your recital last minute. Hundreds of non-required recitals and required graduation recitals happen every year, and everyone wants to do them on a weekend evening in April. The recital paperwork is available to you many months in advance for this exact reason. You can choose several possible recital dates along with your desired venues in the building in the order of your preference, and then select your priority between the date and the venue. Back Seats of Greenfield Hall Lectures my history professor once told our class that only the first five rows will get a decent mark on their exams. Okay, that might be a slight exaggeration, but the moral of the day is to avoid the back seats if possible. Because the professors use acoustic lecture styles almost at all times, it's hard to hear them if you sit way back in the hall. Unlike instruments, human voice doesn't travel very far, and being where you can't even hear the lecture is the opposite of the reason that you go to school. The sushi rolls, cold sandwiches, and desserts sold in the little fridges in the cafeteria. No, put that down. I repeat, do not buy any of these things. If you don't have any choice but the cafeteria, maybe the hot grill section or even the sandwich bar will do. Or get a piece of fruit. Just don't pick up any of those cold, pre-made sandwiches, sushi rolls, or the desserts. They're sad, dry, definitely not fresh, tasteless, and ridiculously overpriced. Entering the school building on a pre-college Saturday. Beware, parents and children are everywhere you look. All you need is one good look at the lobby, library, and the cafeteria. You won't ever want to sit down anywhere with that many people around. It's absolutely impossible to find one empty practice room or even a seat in the library. If you're lucky enough to find a seat, better have some serious noise-canceling headphones or earplugs because no one will use inside voices. So for more tips and tricks on colleges and universities, check out our website.